today I decided to invite two of the biggest doctors when it comes to hair loss, Dr. Ronagi and Dr. Mayer. Thank you so much for coming on the show. Thank you for having us. Welcome to the Make It Warmer show and thank you for helping us all with this big issue. So tell me, how does hair loss even happen? So Megan, I am so sorry to hear about your story. I That's know. traumatic. It sounds traumatic. Like, and you know, as a woman, like we hold big pride in yes. having beautiful hair and I was miserable, not gonna lie. Like I didn't want anyone to come too close to me. I was always like walking around like this. I was always trying to hide it because it was such a big spot. I couldn't even hide it. Yeah. I couldn't hide it with anything. Especially because for women, it's such a source of our like youth and our beauty yeah. and our power. I, I mean, even lions have a mane. I know, and, right? Like, it's like, are you kidding me? How can we lose our hair? So I'm so sorry to hear it about that. It's definitely not the most common way that we lose hair. So. I know, but I, it made me start sympathizing with everyone who's dealing with this issue. It's a big issue. I know all men out there, like a lot of them, they're dealing with the, you know, in, in, even in their early 20s, they're dealing with, you know, thinning hair and hair loss and women after pregnancy and when they hit menopause. Mm -hmm. I know it's a very, very upsetting issue for all of them. Thanks to you guys and thanks to companies like HairMax for, you know, coming up with a solution. So what is, um, what is the main reason for hair loss? So the most common cause of hair loss is androgenetic alopecia. Okay. Androgenetic alopecia uh, in males presents itself by uh, receding hairlines, thinning of the mid scalp, and uh, thinning of the, of the vertex. In okay. females, it uh, presents itself by the thinning of the of the temple area and generalized this area, right? Yeah, mm -hmm. exactly. And it generalizes the uh, thinning of the scalp. Oh wow. And uh, yeah, so as we age, uh, you know, the, our hair follicles. Uh, become thinner and weaker mm -hmm. and that's called miniaturization thanks to hair max products that helps to reverse those that process so it's so, better it's best to use it as early as possible yeah, versus so, waiting right as so, a per, you think do you think hair max can be a preventative device when it comes to hair loss absolutely okay uh, hair max would be a preventative device when it comes to hair loss wow yeah and what about hair loss in females do you deal with a lot of that? Oh my gosh, so much. And so just like you, I lost a ton of my hair. I was actually diagnosed with something called Hashimoto's thyroiditis. Oh. And so it's an autoimmune thyroid disorder right. where you get extreme thinning of your hair. And then as you were mentioning, I had two kids and then went through that whole trauma of losing hair after childbirth, but it never came back. And I was devastated. And I know as a functional dermatologist that specializes in natural solutions for people's skin and hair health, most of everything out there was anti-androgens, anti-hormones. Mm -hmm. And I didn't want that for myself. Right. I wanted a natural solution and that's where I discovered HairMax. It has had so many published studies in the literature about, you know, bringing the hair back in a natural, safe and effective way. And the best part for me is that at the end of the day, as a busy doctor mom that runs her own practice, you know, I could just wear the cap 15 minutes every other day on my way to work. Wow. So how does it how does it work? Well, I know how it works. I literally just put it on my head and it goes yeah. to work. But, um, okay, so let's start with this one, right? So I always use this one when I'm on the go because this one is just, I just put it on, it's so fast, it doesn't mess with my hair. But then I actually use the cap every time I'm driving because that one is cordless. I think it's the only cordless uh, hair loss device in the world. And I use it, I put it on, I go, you know, I go about my business. So how does it work? How does the uh, technology work? So the technology works based on photobiostimulation. Okay. And that basically means when, it's just like when the sun hits the plants, it starts rejuvenating the plants. Mm -hmm. It's the same concept. So when the, when the LED laser lights hit the, the follicles, when you're wearing the cap, it rejuvenizes the hair follicles brings more oxygen to the hair follicles and uh, uh, just more nutrition as an, and as a result you'll have a nicer fuller hair wow yeah. i love that and then what is the difference between all of these devices so we have three different types we have this one we have the headband so what is the difference so the uh, this device here is uh, basically the same one as you're wearing and uh, it's the 82 uh, hair max um, um, hairband. 
Okay. Yeah. yeah. What does it do? So the one thing I love about that one is especially for girls, we sometimes get our hair done and like you, I use it on my drive to work. Right. So I love the fact that the combs separate the hairs. So oh. it actually lets the laser light get into the scalp. Like this. Exactly. Yeah. And right. so it's like a comb. Exactly. And so love the beauty it. of it with the photobiostimulation uh -huh. is that it allows oxygen and nutrition to actually bathe that hair follicle. And instead of thinning and miniaturizing, it sort of strengthens the hair and brings it deeper into the skin, okay. which is similar to like a tree and landscaping. Oh, wow. When you have good plumbing, you basically have a very nice, hearty, thick, trunk, healthy tree, okay. similar to the hair follicle. Right, right, right. And then similarly, as we age, as we go through menopause, hormonal shifts, autoimmune diseases, our hair follicles thin and fall out. But this technology helps strengthen that hair follicle, bring it deeper into the skin, and supply it with the oxygen, the nutrition, everything it needs so that the wow. soil of the hair is better. It's better. Wow. This feels, you're right, because it's like a comb, so it combs through your hair, yeah. so you feel like the laser light is hitting to your scalp directly. And this one is similar, but the comb um, teeth are a little like softer, so yeah. it doesn't divide your hair as you know sharply as this one does. But my favorite, I love flip, only because like basically so, so you have like eighty laser lights on, on one side and another eighty on the other side, and you put it on and then. Ta-da! <laughs> yes, I know. Stylish. I literally wear it on my way to work every day. And sometimes sometimes I just look around and I'm like, do people know that I'm literally growing my hair as I'm driving? I know. That's the best part. That's the best part. So there's been numerous clinical studies behind the device, right? T tell me about the studies. Yeah, so HairMax has actually been a pioneer in the laser hair cap technology for hair restorations mm -hmm. since I was a resident in medical school. So what I would say is it's got numerous published studies and they show 90% safety and efficacy. So that's the most important thing. And they've really done clinical studies throughout some of the most major clinical hospitals in the United States. Mm -hmm. It shows that one square inch of hair will have 129 new hair follicles after six months of using wow. this device three times a week. I'm the perfect example. Yeah, wow. Yeah, really. And you'll notice you just get new baby hairs. So literally along my hair, because I still use the, the device, I'm constantly getting new hairs. And that's, I attribute that to really using this technology. Well guys, thank you so much for coming on my show. And thank you for helping people become the better version of themselves.